Hello everybody, Swaminath here. Today we are going to see support tickets. Support tickets in SAP WM, Barrows Management, MM and WM, we can say. So this is the support ticket, MM and WM, very high, critical. Maintain number range interval for quants. Not able to place the stock in the warehouse. So this is the error message and they have given the data also. This is the material. So status is open. Let's go to the SAP live system. This is my SAP system. Go to, I'm going to create a purchase order, ME21N, with the material they have provided. Enter the vendor. Enter purchase organization 1111. Purchasing group. Enter the material. This is the material they have given. 6867. 6867 is the material they have given. Press enter. Enter the quantity 10. Enter net price. Enter plant 1111. Enter storage location. 0001 is the storage location. So save. Let me save this. This is my purchase order now. Let me go to the purchase order in goods received. So in the goods received, they are getting this error message. Let's go to the goods received slash and MIGO. We go. Enter the purchase order number. Press enter. Item OK. Post. Now they, they are getting this error. See, this is the error message. Maintain number range interval for quants. So this is the error message. So it is related to the number range. Number range not assigned to the warehouse. My warehouse is WM0, WM1 is my warehouse. Go to SPRO, SAP reference IMG. Go to logistics execution. Here it is, logistics execution. Select warehouse. Master data, go to master data, scroll down, number ranges for transfer requirement, for transfer requirement, WM0, WM1, sorry, WM1 is my warehouse, interval, click on to interval, so this is the number range, I'm going to add a new number range, let me take it, take this, add the number range. 0 to is my number range from 1 triple zero triple zero zero one two two zero 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 press enter and save save it continue so number two so now come back i'm going to assign the number range for Transfer order, transfer request, everything. WM1. WM1 is my warehouse. WM1. See, no number range is assigned. 0 to is my number range. For, for quant. Transfer order 0 to, transfer request 0 to, posting change 0 to, 0 to, 0 to, select this. This is number range assignment one for storage unit one present see we will select this the internal number range and use previous numbers so, press enter and save now let me create the goods result and check it come back let me create the goods receipt for the purchase order we have created. Go to MIGO. This is the purchase order number. Item OK. Post. Maintain number in the table 024 once. Again, another error. Let's go to slash and SPR. SAP reference IMG, scroll down, process execution, warehouse management, master data, define number rings. 
response wm01 intervals at 02 from this two and save. Now come back. Go to me go and let me do GR MI zero. Let me do the GR. Item OK post post. It has got posted. Let's go to select display. Let me go to the metal document. Press enter. See, go to WM warehouse management tab. See, this is TR number, transfer request number. Transfer request number. This is TR number. So, from here, I'm going to do TO and confirm the TO. Go to LT04. Transfer request. WM1. WM1 is my warehouse card. TR number is this number. Press enter. Save. Go to create a TO and confirm the TO. Number range 02 for transfer order. Again, go to SPRO. This is, I have created another one. SAP reference IMG. TO. 02. Go to logistics execution. Logistics execution. Go to warehouse management. Master data. Number reach. TO. For TO. WM1. Interval. Add 02. This is my number range. Save. Now come back. Go to now go to LT04. Press enter and save. Now save. Now come back. Go to LT12 for confirmation. Press enter and just confirming that. See, this is the bin it is going to get stored. This quantity 10 is going to store in. 6667. It's going to store in this bit. Now save it. Now save it. So I have confirmed it. Confirm the transfer order. Now come back. Go to LX03 to view the material. Okay, storage type 001. Storage pin. This is the pin. Execute. See here, it has been stored in this. This material stored in this bin. Material number 666. So this is how we rectify the ticket. Go and close this. Close. This ticket stands closed. Thank you.